to you and talk about a very, very important topic, which is United States Citizenship and Immigration Services and all the activity around that. Of course. So um, USCIS recently submitted our customer experience strategic plan to the Department of Homeland Security Headquarters Customer Experience Directorate, which I know you've had Dana Chisnell on the program as well. Um, and this was an initiative that they stood up back in July, asking all of the component agencies here at DHS to submit something that would talk about how we're strategizing around customer experience and really cementing a vision within our, our component agencies to make this real, make this concrete. So our plan at USCIS focuses on improving customer experience coordination across the agency. Um, we have plenty of customer experience tools and uh, experience to set us up for success, but how are we getting really the most bang for our buck, if you will, out of making all of these investments that we've already made? whether that's bringing in tools, whether that's training staff, whether that's bringing in new staff. And so um, we have over 100 user experience designers in our IT shop. We have human-centered design specialists working in our humanitarian programs. And, you know, we're working right now to stand up a voice of the customer program, but it's by putting all of this together that's going to help us get good conversations about what it means to continue to mature our practices. And by putting together that plan that was galvanized through DHS asking us to put together this strategy, we were really able to look around and sort of identify who the most ready partners are and who the folks are that really needed us to help hold hands and cross the finish line together to submit. And now we're in a phase where we're able to sort of do that work with the folks who did need that help. Um, and we're starting to sort of look at the next phase, which is going around to the parts of the agency that were um, needing a little bit of help and really starting to look at training, look at extra contract support and things like that, and um, really building on our strengths and using our strengths to make sure that the whole of the agency is really ready to work this way. 